What's up guys? We are back today with another mystery box. But this one is special. This box is special because they're super, super hard to get your hands on. Um, so the company that I got this from is Woot. Um, if you don't know what Woot is, it's kind of like if Amazon, which is its mother company, I guess you could say, and Wish had a baby, and that baby didn't get any of the real, real, real bad shipping times from Wish. But Woot, they have an app, super, super great deals a lot of the time. But this time, we got a bag of crap. Doesn't sound too pleasant, I know, but these things are super, super sought after for the people that know about Woot. And pretty much, as soon as they go up, they're gone. And they don't really tell you how many are in each run or any of that kind of stuff. But it quite literally is just a bag of random crap. Um, and this is the very first one that I've ever gotten my hands on. And I tried many, many times that day of the loot off. It was a couple weeks ago. And I got stuck in the vestibule patience multiple, multiple, multiple times. And it really, really tested my patience. But we got a hands on one. This one is called the Basket of Carnage. And I cannot wait to see what kind of crap we can pull out of this box. So make sure you go check out the Woot app. They always have some really awesome t-shirts and just, I mean, super, super great deals. Um, yeah, and if you have Prime, you should get free shipping from Woot as well. Uh, I've also gotten things in the past, it was like OMG deals from Woot and you paid 10 bucks. I got one of the little Yeti Rambler glasses, it's worth like 20 bucks. I got that and then here recently they had their ultra or super fun price or super fun, fun pricing or yeah, something. Anyway, they release a, a um, I want to say object, but I know that's not the word I'm looking for. They released a product for $1, and there's only so many items at that dollar amount that you can get, so you got to be the first one to get to it. And I just got, I got a, I got some coffee from the Black Rifle Company uh, being shipped to my house right now, too. So, awesome stuff. There's a game you can play every day to try to win bags of crap. I have not been lucky on that yet. But I did get one, let's get into it. All right, so the first thing you see when you open the box, it says, until next time. If it'll focus. All right, so that's the bag that's in the box. They always throw a bag in these boxes from what I've seen. I guess that helps throw in the bag of crap aspect of it. I'm gonna see if we can get it to focus. All right, yeah, it's not gonna want to. But, super cool bag, use it to get groceries. Uh, do whatever you want to with it, honestly. All right, there's a bunch of stuff in here. All right, the first thing we have, let's go ahead and break this open it is an NRA like a key holder you hang up in your house somewhere it's a pink camouflage yeah like cardboard stuck to the back of it yeah camera's really not wanting to focus today I don't understand what's going on with it um but yeah 
That's the first thing we pull out of our bag of crap, other than the bag. Um, next up, we have a little, looks like a puppet. Yeah, we got a little pirate puppet. You stick your fingers in over here. Arr, matey. Yeah, we got us a little pirate puppet. I'm sure my kids will love that. We'll definitely be playing with that in the near future. That's super cool. All right, next thing we can pull out of this box. Canning wand. Wand. Oh, okay, so it's, I guess it has to do with when you're canning something, you put it in, put it on top of the lid or something, and yeah, it helps it seal. Yeah, that sterile hands-off transfer of the lid. That's pretty cool. Uh, might get into canning. Um, uh, I know the wife and I are going to start a garden this year, so shoot, we might even get some use out of that. Alright, then we got two magnets. Baseball magnets. So I'm not a huge fan of baseball. Um, more of a football kind of guy. But we got a Tampa Bay Rays magnet right there. And an Arizona Diamondbacks magnet. Those are super cool. Like I said, I'm not a huge fan of baseball, but I'm sure someone on the interwebs somewhere will want one of these or both of these or, heck, I don't know. Um, all right, next up, what is this? All right, we've got cookie cutters, three of them. Just kind of randomly floating in this box. Looks like a that's gonna be, yeah, that's gonna be fun. All right, let's see if we can. That's not gonna help. Put it up against this blue back. See if you can see it better there. All right, so it looks kind of like a fox. Yeah, that's pretty cool. We don't make a lot of cookies here. Probably need to cut back on eating the cookies here. Um, but in the future, when we do make cookies, we might get a chance to cut them out in the shape of little foxes or wolves or whatever animal that is. All right, next we have official Woot licensed. Oh, shit. Shoot. Lip balm. Yeah, that's gonna be tough to focus on. The trouble I've had all day today. All right. Yep, it just says whoop there on the top. Got some lip balm. All right, next out of the box, we've got some t-shirts. All right, what's this say? So it said, I'm sorry, Dave. I'm afraid I can't do that. I think you know what the problem is, just as well as I do. The mission is too important for me to allow you to jeopardize it. Dave, this conversation can serve no purpose anymore. Goodbye. Press any key to continue. So I'm assuming that is a quote from something, video game, movie, something, not completely sure what it is. All right, next we've got another shirt. Oh, this is a little shirt. This might fit my two year old. All right. Like I said, Woot is known for their shirts and they got some really cool ones. But this one is a mountain scene with an escape button from a keyboard behind it. That's pretty cool. Yeah, that's definitely gonna be kept around the house for my two year old. All right, we've got something big in here. Okay. Never fails to amaze what may amaze me what you can find in one of these bags of crap. So I have a large plus 10 to 12 
children's costume for Halloween. This is the broken doll. Uh, my kids, my daughter is not near this age. She's about to turn one. Um, might keep it around the house. Might put it up on the internet to see if anyone is interested. I have no use for a 10 to 12 large plus girls Halloween costume at the moment. That is funny though. It, like I said, never fails to amaze me what you can find in these boxes. Alright, and there's one more thing in this bag of crap or basket of carnage, whatever you want to call it. It is a sticky poop. And this, we have dogs, so this is going to go to my kids, but it's going to last about 12 seconds and then we're going to have to throw it away because it's going to be covered in hair that it somehow finds on a newly vacuumed floor. Um, yeah, we got a golden sticky poo. So, all in all, we got some pretty cool stuff out of this a bag of crap from Woot. Uh, make sure you go check out the app, download the app, just watch for great deals. They've got cool stuff going up all the time, and you will always know when they're going to do special events like Woot Offs where you can find these bags of crap and try to buy them for yourselves. Alright, so... This video was a little different today, but I want to thank you for stopping by. Um, if you like the content, uh, we're going to try to get more bags of crap in the future, so there will probably be plenty more of these where this one came from. Make sure you hit that subscribe button. Ding that bell notification so you're alerted when new videos go up on the channel. And hit that thumbs up if you like the content. Once again, thank you for coming.